assalamu alaikum welcome to my channel computer gateway this channel have tutorials on the subject of introductions to information and communication technologies according to the syllabus of punjab university of bscs students in today's lecture i will explain the word processing software in detail students before i start my tutorial on word processing software you should know what is a word processor a word processor enables you to create a document store it electronically on a disk display it on a screen modify it by entering commands and characters from the keyboard and print it on a printer word processing software it is a type of computer program that allows users to create edit and print documents it is a software application that provides a range of tools and features to manipulate text layout and formatting word processing software is used to create documents from scratch edit and revise existing documents format text and paragraphs such as font size color alignment add images tables and other elements check spelling and grammar print to export documents to various file formats examples of popular word processing software include microsoft word google docs libreoffice writer adobe in copy Lotus Word Pro, Claris Works, Microsoft Works, Apple Works. Students, this is the interface of the most well-known and widely used word processing software that is Microsoft Word. It is developed by Microsoft. This slide shows the interface of Google Docs. Google Docs is a free web-based word processing and document management tool offered by Google. LibreOffice Writer has this type of interface. LibreOffice Writer is a free and open source word processing application that is part of the LibreOffice software suite. It is designed to be compatible with Microsoft Word and offers many similar features. This slide shows the interface of Lotus Word Pro. Lotus Word Pro is a word processing application that was part of the Lotus Smart Suite software package. It was developed by IBM and was popular in the 1990s and early 2000s. Claris Works. It is a full-featured word processor package published by Claris for Apple Macintosh and Windows operating system. Students, Microsoft Word 2010 is the word processor that is the successor of Microsoft Word 2007. Microsoft Word 2010 offers the most enhanced features to create professional quality documents. It is designed to give you the finest formatting tools and also helps you to easily organize and create your documents more efficiently. Word processing software is used by students for writing papers and essays or assignment, professionals for creating reports, proposals and documents, authors for writing books and articles, business for creating letters, memos and marketing materials, and legal team for preparing contracts, agreements and court documents. Students, this is the interface of Microsoft Word 2021. As you can see, at the top of the window, title bar present, which have information about name of the window, application or document. It also has Windows control button, which consists of minimize, maximize and close button. These buttons are used to change windows size and state. This section is the ribbon section of Microsoft Word 2021. 
Ribbon section is a horizontal bar that is located below the title bar and contains a series of buttons or tabs that consist of various commands such as Home, Insert, Design, Layout, etc. Then moving forward to the cursor key. This is the cursor key of the Word document. Cursor key or insertion point is the point where your text is inserted or edited in a document. This is the working area of the Word document. You can write text here. And this horizontal bar located at the bottom of the window shows the information about the current status of documents such as page numbers, word count, etc. Students, the bar that appears on the right side allow us to navigate and move through the content of the document that is larger than the visible area. It is of two types. This bar is vertical bar and the horizontal bar lies at the bottom of the window. Zoom buttons are the control located in the status bar allows you to adjust the magnification level of your document. You can increase the zoom level by pressing plus button and decrease it by pressing minus. Word processing software typically includes features such as text editing, font styles and sizes, alignment and justification, indentation and spacing, tables and columns, images and graphics, headers and footers, page numbers and breaks, spell check and grammar check, save and export options. Students, let's move to the Microsoft Word 2021 interface for text editing. Students, welcome to the screen of Microsoft Office Word 2021. Let's start with the text editing. Text editing refers to the typing process of creating and modifying text for the sake of accuracy and clarity. To add text onto your document, you should have to position the insertion point into the place where you want to add the text. This is the insertion point and I can write here text like this. Then you can type with the help of the keys of the keyboard. You can write small as well as capital letters by on and off caps lock key. For next line, enter key is used to give space between letters. You can use spacebar key. To remove any character, you can use backspace key like this. The procedure of cut and pasting of the text is as follows. Students, you can cut the text by selecting the required text like this. Press and hold the mouse left button and drag it to the required area. The text is selected or highlighted as you can see from the screen. Then press Ctrl plus X from the keyboard. Ctrl plus X is the shortcut key to cut the text. After this, set the cursor and by pressing Ctrl plus V, the text return back to the screen like this. Students, you can also do it by pressing the right mouse button and selecting the option of cut. Students, you can also make the copy of the text and place it to your desired location by pasting. For copying the text, you select the text first like this and then press Ctrl plus C key from the keyboard. After setting the cursor, you press Ctrl plus V from the keyboard and the copy of the text appears on your screen like this. Students, 
here you should notice one thing that copy commands duplicate the selected text while cut command removes the text from its original location to your desired location students you can format your text with the help of these options this section contains different options like font style size color bold italic underline etc font styles and sizes students the font option is available in the home tab to apply formatting your text should be selected you can change the style size and color by clicking on the required option for example if you want to change the style of your text you can do it from this option similarly you can change the size of your text by pressing this option and you can change the color of your text from this option alignment and justification alignment refers to the position of text in relation to left and right margins margin is a area from where text begins and ends for example this is the margin area of the text while justification refers to the distribution of text within a line to fill the available space this section of home tab contains option of alignment and justification students you can align your text to left right and center with respect to margin area before doing alignment your text should be selected like this after selection of your text you can choose this option to left align your text or you can press control plus l from the keyboard you can also choose this option to center align your text and its shortcut key from the keyboard is control plus e or you can choose this option to right align your text its shortcut key from the keyboard is control plus r students as we have discussed earlier that justification is the distribution of text within a line to fill the available space after selecting the text you can left justified right justified center justified and fully justified your text by pressing this option or by pressing control plus j from the keyboard students i have discussed the features of text editing font styles and sizes alignment and justification in this video the further features will be discussed in the next lecture till then don't forget to like share and subscribe my channel thank you